grew up in Colorado with my mom and dad and my little sister. And I lived in the same house my whole life, but I was never outdoorsy. I didn't ski, I didn't go outside. I was an actor, so I'm like, I, I want to be on stage, I want to be inside. My parents, um, they, there were some challenges. We would all yell and scream at each other if we were fighting, but we had to talk it out. My upbringing was very strange. We were Baptists. If you know about Baptists, if you hear a song, you can tap your foot or tap your hand, but you can't do both because that's dancing. You can't do that. My dad and mom, they had a strong marriage and they're still together, but I didn't really want their thing. I wanted my thing. And my thing had to be like in a movie, right? When the, the lights all go off and you see her for the first time and it's this beautiful moment. I'm positive you don't remember the first time you met me. No, I don't. Yeah, I know you don't. I remember the first time I met you, though. It was like in the movies. I just knew this girl's important. And of course, she wanted me back, totally. No, I did not. He had the longest ponytail. Oh, we don't have to talk about oh, that. Oh, yes, we do. He liked medieval things, so. Well, yeah, I like to do like reenactments okay. and things like that, which so, is not much more normal than having a, a ponytail least, for no reason. Least, anyway, so we were going to do Little Shop of Horrors. We did the play and it was fine. It, was, it actually worked out great. Well, okay, don't get the wrong idea. It was like pulling teeth some days, especially in rehearsal. <laughs> she was mean cool and she was mean, mean because I was weird. And I was true. weird because I knew she didn't like it and she was being mean to me. Well, so. again, you had a ponytail. Long. Anyway, you know, so lots of people have ponytails. Not that lots long. Lots of cool people. Have not ponytails. that long. But um, we kept getting cast together, kept getting cast together. And of course, if you're in a play, you know, you hang out together a lot. We actually were hanging out. We were kind of dating for a whole year before. Uh, no, 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 three years. I waited well, three you years. Did. No other girlfriends, <laughs> no other dates. And it I, wasn't well, just because of you. It wasn't. But I just enough. waited. We were going to movies, we were going to dinners, and I was thinking we were just dates. friends. Those are dates. I was right? thinking we were just friends. And I was t in total denial. So after a year, I was finally like, are you ever going to ask, ask me, out? me out? I'm in the middle of my pumpkin spice latte. And I'm, <laughs> yeah, uh, <clears throat> you want to go out with me? We can uh, that was it. do a, a movie like last week. We came from uh, very different backgrounds where, you know, your family talks, but you you talk a little loud sometimes, and my family doesn't talk, but we're we're quiet. I went to your house, and your family is screaming Boisterous. at each other, <laughs> and and I'm sitting in the corner, just terrified on my yeah. mind. And then you came to my house, and, and just calmly, and, and uh, we'll start to argue or something, and then everything dies down. And you're like, is that it? There's nobody talking about this. And there's not many things that really get under my skin, but one of them is when it's. Um, uh, almost like a, a bombardment. Oh, I hate what I'm wearing, and it's like, bam! I hate where we're going, bam! I hate the people we're seeing, bam! What, what's good about today? I don't know, bam! I think for sure money can be a challenge. You always had trouble holding on to it. Very easy for me to spend money. That was a challenge. That was a big one. I think that was the biggest challenge we actually have. It's fun now to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, boy. Want to answer on three? Uh, sure. Okay, ready? One, One two, two, three. three. Yes. Uh, yes. 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 <laughs> yeah. It's been almost a decade that we've been together. And we've been married for three years. Three years. I don't know wow. if I could even drive home without you. That's a good point. I, I kind of navigate it. everything. Yeah, you're the one that does the math. <laughs> You value yourself as an individual, and you give me space to be an individual. Yeah. And we are who we are together. And we're still best friends. Yeah, we are. After all, all this time. time. <laughs> Did you just see that? I just knew exactly how I wanted my life to go, and I found you. That's when everything started going better. Every day after I met you gets better and better and better. And I think that I've, I've helped raise up those things that you were lacking and learning how to communicate and learning how to how to express yourself. And I think you've helped tame my your, my raginess, your, your raginess. my temper. You, you really have. It's nice to be to kind of fill those voids and, and yeah. help raise each other up rather than bring each other down. Maybe that's it, finding the part of you that you're missing in somebody else. Yeah. I love you. I love you too. So pancake.